What up, everyone? Testing, testing, one, two. What up, everyone? Testing, testing, one, two. All right, it works. Uh, sorry about that. Yeah, I had to uh, unpack testing, testing, one, two. Uh, my TV right, and everything. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, uh, I just wanted to make sure everything is working. So, hello, everyone. Welcome to the stream. We're not going to play just yet, so if you're watching later... Um, it's just, you know, I'm set up and everything, but I just want to give a few more minutes for people to come in and I want to say hi to people. So feel free to jump in the chat. Let me know how you're doing. Let me know how you're surviving this, you know, collapse of our society, uh, this pandemic that's going on, uh, which has been really scary to watch. I mean, literally life changes every hour. Something that we've all known and done and take for granted changes every single hour, it seems. So, uh. So it's, yeah, it's crazy times. Uh, so if you're here, jump in, chat with me, and uh, and we'll get the game started here shortly. Uh, let me just make sure everything else is working. I know audio is working, so that's good. And I want to at least uh, engage with somebody before... Uh... Plus, I'm starting a little early. I told people 15 minutes, like 10 minutes ago. So I'm going to try to give people a few more minutes to get in here. So again, if you're watching this later, uh, after the live stream... So you can skip ahead a few minutes, maybe like five or six minutes from now, and we'll probably get started. Whoa, what's up, Andrew? How's it going? How are you, sir? Uh, how are you doing, man? How are you? Are you staying safe? Uh, how How is uh, everything in your neck of the woods? Uh, I'm going to miss you, man. I know we haven't done too many more events together uh, between our last one and, and now, but uh, I'm going to miss you, dude. Now, I'm going to keep up with your, your stuff, and your photography stuff is looking great. Uh, I've been loving seeing those posts um and i miss your like updates your vlogs like when you would like do them on instagram and stuff just like kind of talking to the camera i kind of miss those too so i don't know if you plan on doing more of those but uh yeah thanks for being here man i haven't played this yet uh so i'll I, and i haven't seen anyone play it yet uh i am a big fan of a guy named where's barry who does uh exclusively resident evil channel and i was uh i saw that he had posted some videos and i I went in, like I clicked on him to watch him, and I hit the like button just to kind of support him, and then I I bowed out. I didn't watch anything uh, because I didn't want to spoil this for me, because I honestly didn't think I was gonna play this. Like I was, you know, I have so much to do. I'm moving in just a couple days, and I had to go to U-Haul today. They had to install a hitch on my car. I got a couple more boxes, came back and boxed up stuff uh, for my move. Um, I had to sort the, uh, like thousands and thousands of Lego brick uh, for a friend of mine. I mean, I didn't have to, but he he offered me. Uh, a chance to do it uh, for you know a couple dollars, which was really nice of him, um, because I'm going to need some extra money for the road. So, uh, so I was like, yeah, no problem. I, you know, he has a project coming up, and and he was like, I was like, yeah, dude, I'm happy to help. Um, and so I was doing those for the past couple nights, uh, staying up till like 5 a.m., getting it all done. And uh, and now that that's all loaded in my car and ready, I'm going to go meet him in a few hours to give him, hand him over to him. And I got all my stuff packed up. I mean, literally everything except my bed, my desk, my computer. And now my TV and my PlayStation, <laughs> because they were boxed up, my TV and my PlayStation. But I said, you know what? I got everything else done. I got to record a couple podcasts, but I can do that tomorrow and Saturday, and I can have them up Sunday, no problem. And I already recorded all my Venom vlogs. I just need to edit them, which I'll probably do later tonight. Um, and while they're rendering, I'll patch up these last few holes in my wall, and uh, I'll be ready to go. So, yeah, I'm doing good. I'm, I'm doing all right, trying to stay ahead of everything. I'm trying to leave California before we go on lockdown. Uh, the last thing I need is borders between states to start closing down because then I will, I'll be trapped somewhere, you know, uh, which would suck. So I'm trying to get to Florida as soon as I can. Um, all right. Well, it's been about 15 minutes now, so let's not wait anymore. Let's go ahead and get started with this demo. Uh, story, I guess. The final game may differ from this demo. You cannot save or load your game in this demo. All right, fair enough. This new plague is spreading at a terrifying rate, embedded itself in the corpses already shambling the city streets. Jill has encountered immense difficulties in her attempt to escape the city, but in her most desperate moment, she has rescued. She was rescued by an unknown man named Carlos. Cool. The virus is spreading quickly. Yeah. Well, we know all about that now. This fine young lady could use our help. Ooh, is that Mick Kyle? Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady your name. 
She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. How does he know it's that? Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Ooh, injured. Right. How's that going for you? This city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the 100,000 civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. Jeez. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, that's cool. We can evacuate some. So there's actually people, like actual civilians, that we're saving. We need help. That's one of the things they were missing when in the original game. Was like, it felt like a very selfish mission for Jill to like escape. And it didn't show her being really heroic by trying to save other people. So this is nice that they're adding that. I'm in. But I am on their side. Not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All right. So, so Mikhail's in charge of the unit, huh? I thought uh, Nikolai was uh, head of... Well, maybe he's head of Operation Mad Jackal, which was like their side mission, where he's supposed to go around and, like, get data. First things first. Um... We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. Whoa! She shuffles. What up? Oh, what's he get? There's like herbs and. Oh, there's that liquid. Oh, that's cool. That's an old school health spray. But check that out. There's the the liquid bottles in there from Resident Evil Seven. Oh, that's neat. That they reuse those assets. That's cool. Which way do we go? <laughs> Can we go this way? Shit, nice. Captain. They really took a chunk out of you. Nothing that so they're all... Is. Okay, they're sealed in there, I guess. Hmm. Oh, what's this? UBCS uh, Ammo Crafting Guide. Uh, on the battlefield, if you run out of ammo, your gun's about as useful as a wet fart. Want to stay alive out there? Then get these basic formulas into your skull. Uh, two gunpowders equal handgun ammo. Gunpowder and high-grade gunpowder is shotgun ammo. High-grade times two is uh, magnum ammo. Once you're stocked up, get out there and join the party. Okay. Do we go this way, or did was that just like a... I'm guessing we do. <laughs> so let me go the other way and let's see if there's anything over there to grab. Hmm. Gotta be some items back here, right? I think I saw, I got an email from Capcom saying there's like something called the Charlie mission and it's like all these little I don't know if they're bobbleheads or what. You gotta like destroy them. But uh, I doubt I'm gonna be doing that my first run through. Whoa, check this out. <laughs> How meta is that? Resident Evil 3. Party, party, party. Hey, let's uh, play with me. That's creepy. Um, oh, there's the Terminator type poster, Skull Stalker. And there's like an alien type version next to it. That's cool. That's the poster I posted earlier on my Instagram. It's a Mega Man poster. That's Dr. Wily and Dr. Light from Mega Man. That's cool that they did that. Jim's Crabs. Oh, that's a. I think that's an actual place in Raccoon City. All right, so we can't go. Okay, so this was the the dead end side. I figured some of the one of the sides would be a dead end side. Whoa, hey, look. Awesome. That's one of those uh, bobblehead guys. That's cool. I'm glad I saw that. That was, yeah, I was glad I saw that. That way we don't have to get it later. I think, I don't know if you have to do them all in one playthrough. Maybe you do. 
that's probably what it is because if this doesn't save then that means it won't it won't save the ones we've already shot so well now I know what they look like so that'll be cool I can keep an eye out for them all right let's move what's that freak cinema 19 I love that all the 1998 stuff map raccoon city Can grab any of these no no what was that thought I heard some classic Resident Evil what, what was that noise tabloid front page the Cannibal Murders, a complete digest. Yeah, that's something we talked about before where uh, they assumed that the murders were potential cannibals, and that's what sent the STARS team into the uh, Arkley Mountains. In the gray of the morning of September 25th, a frantic caller telephoned the RPD to report an assault. A man described as disheveled like a vagrant was attacking a passerby north of the Lambs Museum of Art. The responding officers discovered the mutilated corpse of a woman by some dumpsters nearby. Dozens of bite marks covered her body, and she has been dismembered suggesting she had been eaten, the third known incident of its kind to occur in Raccoon City this month. So who done it? Who's been munching on man steak? Ugh, what a typical piece of shit writer. <laughs> Trying to add some weird levity to it. Uh, we here at uh, News Comet have a gnawing feeling that so-called cannibal disease patients, Spencer Memorial has been... Oh, Spencer Memorial? So they, is that the name of the hospital? Has been providing free treatment to a four since August might not be settling for just the cafeteria food. Our reporters have infiltrated Spencer Memorial, asked the tough questions, and come back with horror stories that will make your stomach royal. Royal? Um, turn the page for the scoop. Nope. Looks like it's just the front page. Sorry, I'm gonna. I'm really going to take my time with this. I have nothing else to do today, so... I'm going to look for those bobblehead things. Can you over here? I, st I think I set the settings too dark uh, because I can't Joe? see shit. Me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tank's got me clearing the tracks. You might get in the subway infrastructure back online. And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. All right, copy that. These posters are great. Oh, hey, an herb. Yeah, homie. Combining items. Combine, bro. Oops. Oh, there we go. Cool. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Car alarms. Oh, hey, there's... Cool. That one, I feel like that was an easy one, though. Because that last one, we, like, we just got lucky and saw it behind the train. Oh, here's... What's this? The something bros wa railway? Is this a... Remember in the, uh, in the original Resident Evil 3, there was, like, these cool little things, like, behind some of the puzzles. Oh, Clock Tower commemoration. Oh, that's cool. So it's, like, a nod to the Clock Tower. Um, it kind of looks like that. Oh, that's cool. They, they, in Resident Evil 3, there was, like, these random, I think one or two, these, like, plaques in the city that, like, talked about, like, some mayor that helped change the city, you know, different things like that. Um, now let's keep everything. What's this? UBCS Herb Field Manual. Okay. 
There's no place in the UBCS for uh, pipsqueaks who crawl back to base every single time they get scratched up. You want somebody to kiss your boo-boo? Go someplace else. I love this. Here in the big leagues, we mix our own meds, so get these recipes memorized. Uh, two green herbs is high potency mixture. Green herb and red herb, uh, or three green herbs, is maximum potency mixture. First aid spray, can't make these yourself. Grab them if you see them. Uh, that should do it. Now let's get this done and then go grab a beer. Bunch of hard asses, these guys. Oh man, we're about to go outside, ain't we? It's so dark over here. It's so dark. Any other things to pick up? Any journals to read? No? Alright, here we go. Whoa, that's cool too that there's still people out there. Um, is that a giant bobblehead? Oh. I'm glad I didn't miss with my first shot. That would have been embarrassing. This isn't like Resident Evil 2, like, I have to, like, kill him a hundred times. Whoa, oh, hey, look. Oh, look at that. All right, so far, that's three. I, like I said, I doubt we're going to get all of them on our first playthrough. I don't know where they are, so we'll just, I'll try to keep my eye out for them. Here. That's, wow, this looks amazing. Look at that toy, Uncle. So, okay, so those are little toy uncle bobbleheads, huh? Because it looks like that guy, right? The little mustache and got the suit on. I was thinking there'd be a bobblehead in there. No? Kidoki. Oh, hey, there's the gas station. Haha, <laughs> look at that price. That's how much gas was in 1998, by the way. I had a Jeep Wrangler uh, because because Leon Kennedy had one, and I was a big Resident Evil 2 fan. Um, but, uh, yeah, oh, did someone scream a minute ago? Oh, what up? Oh, wow. What's up, danger? Dang. Took a minute, huh? Dang. I like how she hops around. She's like, cha 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 cha. Careful, my bullets, man. I have a feeling we're gonna get overrun at some point. I like that the knife's unlimited because it should be. I hate it. I didn't really like the knives breaking thing in the last game. I mean, it added a unique challenge. It made you double think the knives, and they were disposable. I guess so. I guess it kind of worked on some level, but. Mm. That's the quick step. Okay. Oh, so you can get in here later in the game, probably. Probably can't do it in the demo, but I'm guessing that's something that uh, Jill can like either lockpick or, <coughs> excuse me, or probably like get like the bolt cutters or something. Just make sure all these guys are dead. Um, hey everyone, welcome in. Feel free to jump in the chat. If, if you're commenting, I'm not seeing it. Um, so I apologize if that's the case. Um, I just hooked everything up like last second, so hopefully hopefully comments are working. I saw Andrew's comment, so, um, so hopefully they're working. Ah, okay, so we'll need the bulk cutters for that. Umbrella noodles, that's 
that's great. <laughs> I don't know if I want to eat umbrella noodles. Any bobbleheads around here? I can see those guys are want some of my my man steak. Look at that Mega Man poster. That's cool. That is so cool. Carlos, I've reached the main avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You'll have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. Fuck you. Wow. Yeah, she wow, she yeah, she does not like uh <laughs> Carlos uh flirting with her. That's for sure. Gotta put this out. What do I need for that? Oh, I need okay. Like a wrench or something? Wasn't there like a wrench and a hose in the in the last game? Oh, what's what's up with that? Does somebody like boost me up to that? Wake me up before you go go. Jeez, that one's straight up climbing it. Dang. Those weights didn't help at all, son. Oh, shoot. Good. There we go. That's what I want. Did I get all three of them? Yeah. Good. Alright, so there's there's gotta be a bobble dude somewhere around here, man. Oh, hold on, I'm getting the um... So ooh, mo moons donuts? Blue Mountain Storehouse. Jim's Crabs, alright. Finally. Finally get some of them crabs. Oh, what up, dog? You want some dying, bro? You want some dying? I gotta be careful. I'm like really running low on ammo. We'll do this. We'll get him to come over this way. Oh, never mind. We'll do the opposite. Come on up, bro. Come on up, bro. Wake me up before you go, go. Sorry, I'm looking for uh, bobbleheads. Uh, ooh, whoop. We, we brought the troops. Must be. Look at that. Bow cutters. Let's put uh, one of those away. One of those away. We'll move that there. Any bubbles in here? 
Can those monsters, can the zombies come in through the door? That would suck. Oh, is this a little, oh, that's a little diner. What's that music? Can we run out the back? Oh, we can. I don't know if I want to. Ooh. Ooh. Cool. Got a few more bullets. Not not a lot, but... Oh, jeez. Oh wow, I went right past those bullets. Dum da dum dum. Oh, he's still alive? I can't believe this guy's still alive. Okay, we got all of them. I'm not doing great on ammo. I'm trying to switch to the knife when I can, but. Like, I'm afraid to go, like, too many places because I don't want, like, the demo to end. Um, you know what? We got those bolt cutters. Let's go back to that shop. And then we'll come back and investigate more down here. Alright, well, he's not a bobblehead that we can shoot, I guess. Don't have no flashlight? Come on, man. Leon and Claire had flashlights. Ooh, high grade. Oh, that's nice. Oh, what up? Oh, let's get a let's get a knife on that one. Nice. Save the bullet. So the medicine pickled veggies. Don't be a prisoner in your own kitchen. <laughs> What's that? First aid spray, all right. Wow, so that's it. You literally just come in here for a, for a bobblehead and um, first aid spray and, and uh, wow, that's, yeah, I thought there'd be more. That's the cool though. Is that a, that's not done though. We're not done with the bulk clippers. I feel like, look how open this is, man. I feel like this would be a great place to put a bobblehead. There's got to be one around here. Oh, what? This guy? They're all still alive? Oh, oh don't even. Come on. How are you going to bite me? He climbed all the way up with one leg. You son of a... I can't believe that guy was still alive. Well, I'll wait till I'm in the red and I'll use the first aid spray. Stay behind his ass. Alright, let's uh we'll go investigate up here.
What's that noise? Oh, it's him. Cool. Nope, oh, nope, that's a zombie. Alright, we're gonna have to use something. There's that ladder! Jeez. Dang! Wow, okay. <laughs> the knife sucks. <laughs> All right. Oh, did I? Oh, I got a headshot. Nice. Oh, that was luck, because I am running low on bullets. And that guy, God, he took some stabbing, bro. There's a wrench there. Why can't I grab it? But if I do, if I combine that and that, I make shotgun shells. But do I get a shotgun in this demo? Okay, back here. There better not be a single one of these things crawling. I will can get mad. Um, all right, let's go up this way and then to the left. To the left, to the left. Mm, don't mind me, just looking for them bobbleheads. Oh, look at that door. It's a nice looking door for this random building. Oh, F that. Drugstore Owner's Journal. August 24th. This new hair tonic from Umbrella is just flying off the shelves. The stuff they always that make always works wonders, so it's no surprise. I was counting on this and ordered a huge shipment. My instincts are paying off. Literally, I just know sales will continue to rise as word gets out. That said, the string of violent incidents on the news has me worried. Maybe I ought to invest in a good safe to hold all this cash that's rolling in. September 2nd. The new safe is just perfect. Nobody knows the code, not even my wife. It's a secret between me and my beautiful Aqua Cure Queen, and she'd never give it up for a thief. Hmm. That's cool, because obviously they, you know, they got to reuse assets. I mean, that they made this game so quickly. Uh, so it looks like, uh, oh, there we go. Combine with that. Sweet. Um... So it looks like they reused even these. These were in Resident Evil uh, 2. These, like, packs of, you know, files or whatever the hell they are. Oh, who's... Oh, what up? Better stay the down, dude. Jill is so chaotic, like, with the stabbing. Like, she, she's, she jumps all over the place. Wait, I hear a... Ah, here we are. I was like, you can hear them. That's good. That's good that you can hear them. I think that's similar to the Resident Evil 7. I think we were able to hear them uh, as well. So we need to find some kind of Aqua Cure. Maybe poster or, or like folder or something. Um, can we just... Uh, I was hoping. Just shatter some glass. Wait, what's this?
Weird. Kite Bros Railway. Is that the store? Yeah, that's the donut place that we cut through. Okay. All right. I just want to make sure we're all like I don't I don't want to get you know. Oh, what up? Oh. Nice. Look, I love how it just it's like, "All right, you're open, you're outside." There's trucks crashed everywhere. Like, this looks freaking-tastic, man. And I heard they, like, outsource some of this to people? To, like, another group to work on it? Uh, holy cow, they did a great job. Wait, Cure. Call me. Wait, what's... It says something. 918? Am I seeing the whole... Yeah... 918, it looks like. All right. Let's go back and put that in. That Yeah, let's go do that first before we move any further. I don't want to, like, leave too many puzzles behind us. Oh, I'm going to go this way. Wait, how? I didn't kill that guy over here. Did I? Look at that. Sweet. Man, I'm glad I saw that post uh, poster. Um, boom. Cool. That's a cool looking add-on to the gun. Wait, there's no other, like... I thought he hid cash in here. Just like Resident Evil 2, there's, like, gun parts and stuff in, in the safes. And uh, I wonder if there'll be extra, like, carrying pouches. His head is split open. Redstone Pharmacy. Oh, wow. Yeah. Running out of room for stuff. Actually, I'm out of room now. I can mix those two and make shotgun shells, but I don't want to do that if there's if we're not going to get a shotgun. And I didn't hear Eagle's Pet Shop. Oh, that's cool. I think that's a that could that could be a Street Fighter reference, or it could even be a, a Mega Man reference. I can't remember, but I think Eagle is another Capcom character. Whoa! For real, bro? God, he scared the crap out of me, man. I'm not kidding. Hear some? I heard someone like shooting. Um, uh, okay. Okay, oh, so we could have just come in here and got that code. Oh, well. I was, like, trying to read it through the frickin' broken window. Yeah, we got it, so it doesn't matter. Oh, good, just, just straight up... Because I was like, watch, I'm going to find another just regular uh, handgun ammo... Or uh, uh, gunpowder. Look at that. Jeez. 
Ah, I, I was gonna say, wait, I think I hear something. All right. I don't know how many of those we got, but I gotta say, if the demo's about to end soon, we did pretty good for our first playthrough. And considering I don't know where the hell any of this stuff is. Um, red herb. Guess I don't need it. Oh wow, we actually, we actually go in here. Okay, I mean, I was, I was figuring because the light was flickering, but still. This is classic Resident Evil, man. Oh, we gotta go in there, huh? Look at those, the, the same vases and stuff from, uh, and buckets from RE7. And then I think they reused them in two as well. That's cool. Oh, shit. Luckily, zombies don't take, like, 40, like, bullets. I mean, I don't know. We ran into one or two that you know, I had to stab a lot. But uh, at least, like, three or four bullets put them down. Especially if you get good, like, headshots or leg shots. What? This place is... Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, hey, look. The hose. Are we going to carry... Oh, Jesus. God, Jill. Uh... How do we... Oh, wow. Is there a safe... Please tell me there's a save room over here. Oh, what up? Let me get a knife in on him. So these we can't open right now, but these we can. Oh, wait. You know what? Hand grenade. And gunpowder. Oh, good. We can do this. Combine. Can we dis... Oh, we can discard. Oh, great. Awesome. Get that hand grenade. Let me go get this hose. Nice. Cool. I'm sure there's other crap in here we gotta get, but... I don't care. I one of the essentials. Subway, employee, memo. Uh, violence getting worse and worse these past few days. Got a shotgun for when it hits a breaking point. Locking it up in the gun rack. Oh, good. A good thing I made shotgun bullets. That should keep it safe from any would-be looters while I go out and try to find some more shells. Things go south, cut the chain, and bust out the sucker. I pray we all make it out alive. Okay, we gotta find... Oh, that's right there. Great. And we can use this. Hopefully that means that is done. Please tell me that means it's we're done with that. Nope, we still, still gotta use that for some... Why? Uh, uh, okay. There's no inventory room around here. This must be the subway company's offices. Kite Bros Railway Manual, ensuring safe subway operations in the event of a power outage, the subway will automatically cease operations once power has been restored. Please use the control panel to confirm the stations at which the train will stop, as well as which track segments will be used if the route entered is unsafe, an error will occur and operations will not resume. Oh, wow, okay. So there's... it's a puzzle. Definitely a puzzle. Nothing. Nothing? What do you mean? All right, I want that shotgun, so we gotta find. We gotta go back to the save room. Way back, like oh, it's in the restaurant, right? So we can just cut into the restaurant. What's that? 
Oh, handgun bullets? Cool. And you, oh shoot. I got myself trapped. Should have just thrown the grenade, but then that way I could have just ran back and got the shotgun. Lesson learned. Any bobblehead dudes back here? Seems like a good spot to put one. Yeah. This was the save room, right? Okay, good. Um... You know, I could just go put the hose on. I guess. Should have thrown that grenade. See, because I kind of want to keep everything. <laughs> like, in case I need, need to use it. Oh, wow, what? Can't pick it up. I'm probably looking right at the bobblehead. There's got to be one around here. Oh, look at that. Good. We can use this. Get rid of it, hopefully. And then go get that shoddy. Yes! Cool. Alright, let's go get that shoddy and then we'll... a pretty good demo like lengthwise like we're already 48 minutes in and um and there's just been plenty to do all right okay so that's probably a main game thing i'm guessing those little yellow locks It's like all these areas where I'm like, well, I'm surprised there's not a bobblehead in here. I bet you there is one, like, just staring right at me. Oh, what up? Ooh, dang, missed. Panic shot, I missed. Wait, wait. All of a sudden, I got really bad at shooting. It's 
See, it sounds still, it still sounds wet, so I'm thinking it's still alive, but it's not moving, so. I think I, th I threw it a little too high, but I'm, I'm glad I used it. I'm keeping these red barrels, because I just feel like there's other ways to get ambushed in this game. Oh, they're all, whoa, is that a UCBS guy? Oh, and I got another grenade. Look at that. Wow, okay, now we're stocked up. Dang, son. Bobble heads, maybe? Anywhere? It's a good place to put one on a ledge up there, but it doesn't look like it. And I don't hear one, do I? Okay, so another optional place. Didn't really have to go there, but good to go there to get rid of the, um, whatchamacallit, clippers. Um, all right, so I guess we got everything we need. We can just go back to the hose, put the hose in. Holy shit! What is that? Oh, whoa, okay. Run, why isn't she running? Okay, dude. It's uh, shoddy time. What the fuck is up with their faces? Oh, thank goodness she has the time to do that. There he is. So I used a... Uh, Alright, I got a good amount of shotgun shells. Where is he? So what is up with that? He's like, what does he do? Take control of him? It's he's got like uh, Las Plagas or something. Where is he? Oh, there's a Mega Man in there. Oh, jeez. Ow! Am I dead? Oh my god, I'm dead! Holy crap! <laughs> oh, man. I thought I was like, oh, I got half-life. I'm sure I'll be fine. Um, I could get a couple shots in, and then I'll use a health spray. And, uh, nope. Nope, not at all. Oh, my goodness, wow. Yeah, I was like, oh, I want to I wanna see a little bit more of them, because I don't know if this is the end of the demo or not, you know? So, um... Okay, here we go. We're back here. Wait, where's my... Where's my shotgun? Are you kidding me, bro? Where's my shotgun? We haven't used all the... Oh, wow. It, it took... It took us back here? What? That makes no sense. So that was my initial... Um, that was my initial grenade. That sucks. <laughs>
Stay down, dude. Oh shit, okay. Damn! Damn! Get up, get up, get up! Dude, he'd like, wow, he... He has combos, he won't let, like, he won't let you up. Dang it, man. Yeah, he, wow, he's a bitch. <laughs> oh, he's a bitch. What a cheap move. Take three shots. And not give me time to heal. Ugh, oh, all right. Well, now I know not to go activate him, because... Because the game set me back in time. Well, we can't even get that right now, anyway. I wish... Why is it... Why did it make me go back to here? Like, that's so weird. Um... Because we had, we had already gotten all this stuff. Okay, I get it. This, yes, right, I know. Dude, discard, bro. Thought he was gonna show up. I was ready to shoot that canister this time. Damn it. Try not to get bit, seek. Once again, I'm stocked up. I'm ready to fight him, <laughs> but I'm not, because when he shows up, I'm going to crap my pants again. Oh, he won't show up over here because I haven't activated him yet. Oh, okay. All right. That's why. Because I was like, oh, why isn't he here this time? But it's because we got to activate him, yo. Oh, that's so gross. It's like the thing. I wanted to just drop him once or twice. Oh, jeez. Crap. Oh, jeez. No, 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 no. I don't want him to punch me, because that's where I die. Alright, still full health. Right, let's get out of here. At least I got a couple shots on him this time. That's all I cared about. Oh, 
jeez. Okay. Should have saved some bullets. Wow. That sucks. Oh, and that's it. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> I should have used more bullets. Oh, man. Twice? I thought I died three times. Did it not count one? And we only found nine. There's 20 of those little guys? Dang, I thought we were doing pretty good on those. I was thinking maybe we missed one or two, but... Dang, 11? I couldn't remember what the email said. I remember the email said something like, find all the Charlies or something, but I couldn't remember. Um, all right, wow. All right. Well, I'm glad I hooked up my PlayStation again and my TV so we could do this because, uh, yeah, like I said, I, I boxed everything up. I'm ready to move. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad I was able to do it. And uh, I'm, I hope you guys enjoyed. I figured, yeah, it's a one-hour stream. Uh, we'll do another one-hour live stream on probably on Sunday morning before I, because I'm going to leave town Monday, uh, like in, like around lunchtime. So uh, I'll do a live stream on Sunday before I box up my computer, you know, and everything and, and say, you know, say my final goodbye. So, um, yeah, this is uh, this was fun. Thank you guys for being here. Uh, Andrew, thanks for being here. Anyone else who popped in? Thanks so much. And if I didn't see your comments, if the comments aren't working, I apologize for that. It does happen sometimes when I stream on YouTube from my PlayStation. I notice that every once in a while the comments won't show up. So if I missed what you guys were saying, I apologize. And I'll try to, you know, get better with that, you know, when I get to Florida and everything. So you all have a a good day. Excuse me, I have the hiccups now all of a sudden. Uh, Y'all have a good day. Thanks so much. See you in the future. Peace. Oh, wait. We got a trailer. Hey, there's Brad. That's cool to actually see them barricade stuff. Who's that? Is that Dario? Whoa! What? Oh. Hey, cool! Oh, there is some Kendo stuff. So Joe hangs out with Terrell for a little bit? That's cool. Whoa, Marvin! What the F is that? <laughs> First thing I do when I get to Florida, I'm setting up on my TV, my PlayStation, everything, and I'm pre-ordering that game. Um, and uh, I will definitely get it, and we will play it day one, for sure. Now that I know I have my own place, because originally when I was moving to Florida, I was going to stay with a friend for like a week or two, but I was like, I don't want to. I want to just get my own place, and luckily I was able to, and now I do have a place, and I'll be in it next Saturday. But it'll probably take me like, you know, two or three days to set up everything. I'll have to get, you know, power I'll have on the day I move in, but uh, and water too. But I think internet and everything, it's going to take some time to set up. But I'll have it all ready, and I promise on April 3rd we'll wake up that morning. I ain't got nothing to do. I ain't working for a few months, so... uh yeah, we'll uh, I'll you know play all this when it comes out. So thanks again. See y'all later. Peace.